explanation. Once there was a donkey who worked hard for long and hard for his master. Now he had grown old and weak and could not do the much work. So his master began to treat him unkindly. He even began to starve the donkey. And then he decided to leave the house and go to Bremen town and earn his livelihood as a town musician. On the way he met an old dog and a cat with the same story. So all of them decided to be a musician and went on. They traveled together for some time. They heard a cock's loud wailing. When inquired, they came to know that his mistress wanted the cook to kill him for the feast. So he got frightened and flew away. He also joined the band of musicians. Bremen was still a long way away. They had to cross a forest. As it began to get dark, the cock flew to the top of a tree and looked for shelter. He saw an old house among the trees and they all went there. Through the window, they saw some robbers feasting at a large table inside. They thought that they will be happy if the four musicians joined them. So all of them started singing all together, but the donkey placed his forelegs on the window ledge. The dog jumped on his back and cat on the dog. The cock perched on the cat's head. Strangely, robbers got frightened with such a terrible noise and saw the huge shadow cast by the animal. They left their stolen riches in the house and ran away. Then all these friends entered the house, had food and put off the light. Seeing dark, one of the robbers came to go back to the house. The man went into the house on tiptoe. He saw the cat's eyes and thought they were burning coal. He tried to pick up one to light his candle. But the angry cat scratched his face. He turned to run out of the house at the doormat. Dog bit his leg hard. He stumbled and fell on the donkey. And he gave a smart kick with his hind leg. And all this while the cock had been screaming. cock a doodle do in his ears. The robber nearly died of fright. Somehow he got back his gang and told them in trembling voice that the house was full of monsters and deadly creatures. So robbers never went back to the house. And all these four friends found enough money in the house to live on there in happiness and comfort. They never went to Bremen.